There is a connection when it comes to cemeteries and Bigfoot. And there's been a lot of sightings around cemeteries. Let's keep on going. Russell for Ronnie and Maria. You guys got a copy? just went out on me. I cannot get it to turn back on again. Yeah. again. Let me see if I can get hold of Bryce. Hey, Russ. Hey, I'm... I was on my way to the coordinate seat for where that heat trace was, and it led me to this old abandoned cabin. It's gotta be over 100 years old. Bryce, do you have any idea why there'd be a cabin out here? This should be really close now. It must be about 50 yards away. Oh, <laughs> Well, we talked about places to hide. Holy Hey, Bryce. Hey, Russell, I found the record of, uh, of an old mining settlement that used to mine this area. They were mining something called cinnabar. This whole area became coffins for these miners. Exposure to this mineral, it says, can cause paralysis, nerve damage, and even death. It smells really strong. Ronnie, Maria, do you copy? Do you copy? Russ, you won't believe what we just found. Looks like an old gold mine shaft. It's not a gold mine. It's cinnabar, a very highly toxic material. Do not go in there. God. With the discovery of the abandoned mine, a possible Bigfoot hiding place, Bryce has left the command center to meet back up with the team at base camp. The abandoned mine is three miles due north of the clearing, where the team has experienced Bigfoot activity, including eye shine and the massive thermal anomaly Russell captured. So while we wait for help to explore this cave, I want the team to scour the area. Hey guys, before you take off, there's something over here I want you to check out. Oh, holy <sighs> I think we just got gifted. This is a big deal. With time running out, all four team members are on their way to inspect the abandoned mine, 10 miles from base camp. Oh, wow. So I think we should split up, see if we can't find something else. Ronnie and Maria will search the area just south of the mine, looking for a path to the clearing that's just three miles below them. Bryce and Russell will explore the site of the ridge directly opposite the mine. Over here. What's that? Look at this. Man. Maria, Ronnie, this is Bryce. Can you read me? Hey, Bryce, we're here. So you're not going to believe this, but uh, Russell just found another cave entrance. This is the perfect way to travel through this area. What better way to slip into one and disappear? This might be the answer. Wow. That is the same smell yeah. that we hear in all of our testimonials. That I've never skunky, smelled that before. That is such a gamey, skunky smell. I feel like all of the answers that we've been desperately searching for lie inside those caves. Hey. Hey, guys. How are we doing? Good to see you guys. Absolutely. A team of drone specialists have arrived to inspect the abandoned mines that could contain a toxic and possibly deadly material. They are meant to go places where you wouldn't normally send a human being. The team will be able to monitor the progress in real time from a dual set of video feeds captured from the drone's point of view. Let's fly this bird. This is the moment of truth. Whoa. Oh. What's wrong? I'm losing signal. That's not good. Uh-oh. Your lost. light just turned red. Yeah, I lost it. It went from almost a perfect connection to just disconnected. Maybe we should reposition to the second cave site and see if we can reconnect over there. All right, sounds good. 
All right, we're here. Let me try to see if I can get a signal back. There we go. Yep. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Oh, this wow. This image here, you could actually see. There's another opening. Looks like two tunnels in there. Holy cow. That's wild. The team has discovered that not only does the mine shaft connect to the tunnel on the opposite side of the ridge, but it splits off into a separate cave headed due west. Whoa. What is that on the floor? That's interesting. Oh, wow. What is that? Does that look like nesting materials? Possible, sure. Whoa. The mine separates again. There could be an entire network of underground mine shafts. Whoa, what's wrong with it? I'm gonna bring it out. I, I, I don't wanna risk going any deeper in there after that. What is that? Are those hairs? That looks like hair. That, that looks, looks like, like hair. Hairs. That looks like hairs. Got it. Right. If we can prove beyond the shadow of a doubt that there was something in that mine shaft that is not on the database. We have so much other evidence. That's all I need. In some ways, this is not the end of the expedition, and I want to be shown more. I want to see more. I want to come out here, and I want to find this thing. I hope I get that chance. <laughs>